Welcome to season three, y'all. I cannot believe we are here. Actually, I can't believe it because I I dreamt it and (laughs) I believed in myself. And we are here. Thank y'all so much for all of you have been rocking with the Growth Project from the very beginning. Y'all know on this podcast, we're all about transformation. We're all about growth. We're all about blossoming into our highest selves, into our best selves, into into who we know ourselves to be be and a lot of you have been witness to this transformation and to this growth over the past couple of years y'all have been listeners um and i really hope for you right now to be able to even look back to where you were three years ago and look back and look at where you are right now and notice the subtle transformations and notice the shifts in yourself and in your personalities and in your outlook and in how you approach life and in what you believe and take notice of all of those things because so much like so much times we don't put energy and focus on the thing on those things and we let them go unnoticed and we we can stay stuck looking at the things that haven't changed versus the things that have. So welcome, welcome to season three, y'all. We are back. We are so excited to be fucking back and to be talking to y'all and to be in your ear every week and to be taking um, your questions and taking your hotline submissions and to be answering and guiding and sharing on this journey. So the title of this season is actually the same title of my upcoming group program. It is called Unwritten. And it's all about understanding and remembering that we are a story being told. We are a story being currently written. We are a story being currently told. Our story isn't ended. And I feel like a lot of us are living like our storybook is and has ended like our book is closed it's been on the shelf it's been taking dust it's been gathering dust since forever and like we act like our book is done it's over with and this chapter of the of the growth journey is all about taking your book off of the shelf dusting it off opening it you know relooking at some of the chapters that you've been through and you know familiarizing yourself with where you've been but then also picking up the pen and deciding that you're going to write the next chapter that you are the author of the next chapter and really taking that power back into your hands and seeing your life as a storybook asking yourself like what is the next chapter of my life where am i going what, what is like the plot what is the character development like and really looking at that So we are really tapping into some main character energy this year, but it's not in this vein or narcissistic or just self-absorbed, self-absorbed way. It's more in this way of understanding that we are the main character of our storybook and there is a plot and there, we have an origin story and we have a villain story and we have all of these things, but ultimately our storybook isn't ended. It is not over. We are currently being written and on written is just a remembrance of being tapped back into the fact that you are part author you're co-author of this thing called life with the almighty and you have the power to write your next freaking chapter and to see where your where your character goes and to enhance the plot in whichever ways you see fit so So join me, y'all, in the remembrance of who you freaking are and in the storybook of your freaking life and marveling in the chapters yet to come. And that's what makes a book so delicious. And that's why we devour them so much. That's what makes a book, a movie, a show, like so intriguing, so wonderful, so delicious, is that sometimes we don't know what's around the corner. We don't know what the main plot is going to be we don't know the plot twist that is going to come some things come and we don't even notice it but more than all we love to cheer for the characters we love to 
tap into their journey we don't look at the first episode and it's the end no we love the journey that it takes us through and that is what life is that what's your life is as well so why close the book now and think that you've seen everything you've known everything when it comes to your life and that your life is over your life is still being written right now and Y'all know that on this podcast, we're all about, like I said, transformation and becoming and blossoming into the beautiful butterflies that we are and taking all of the gunk and taking all of the shitty things that have happened to us and transforming and transmuting them into art, into power, into wisdom, and ultimately into a story worth telling. So join me on season three of the podcast. And join me in my upcoming program on Written coming this June for hidden babes, hidden light workers. Those of you who know that you are meant to shine, you have this big ass purpose in your heart, and you're just looking for the ways, for the vehicles, for you to now create, for you to now deliver that message, deliver that freaking medicine that you have live your purpose write your story take control of your narrative and if that is you and you are hiding yourself you are overthinking you're never posting your content everything stays in your drafts you um feel unworthy or you feel just like you're not good enough and your stuff is not good enough unwritten was made for you you are going to leave this program feeling so much more tapped into who you really are, your message, your medicine, what you're really here to do, and really understanding that truly you you get to write your next chapters. And by building the confidence and the self-belief, which is ultimately just what you're lacking right now, not not all of the things that you think you're lacking, just confidence and self-belief. And that by building those things that you will see that you are and you will be unstoppable. So the information for the program and, you know, the nitty gritty, the sales page and all that will be down below. You guys can read up a little bit more about it, but I would love to see so much of you beautiful souls in Unwritten. If not, sit back, buckle up, and get ready for yet another transformative season. As always, I thank y'all so much for being here, for joining, and for witnessing, and I can't wait to share all that I have with y'all. So I hope that y'all enjoy, and I will see you on the other side. Mwah.